Hello everybody, today I will show you how to make a Tapa controller in Xcode 7 and also in iOS 9 and today I will introduce you more detail about it okay before we get things start together please make sure you create a new application project a single new application already and here this is screen that I have been create a new project already and I hope you guys create already the same okay let's go ahead to create together okay here W controller in menstrual report and you need to click this icon on the top view controller and go to editor and click embed in and then you can select the tab controller okay when you click this you will see that this as you can see okay and it is a like way that point to this view controller as a root view controller and tab on the one the view controller and you need to do what you need to do is to create a view controller one more drag from the object library okay sorry and drag it yeah here and move and you need to press the control key or you can right click on this and drag into okay drag it into the view controller okay wait oh you cannot track that you need to press control hold on the control and track into the view controller and you choose the uh, relationship subway and view controller like this okay you as you can see it will show two tabs okay i will show you i just change the color like this whatever you want and i will can click this okay use this color okay here and run together to see the result of this okay wait a little bit so it takes a little bit time to run the application and start up the simulator. Okay, here. And wait a bit. Here. Okay, here as you can see here the tab bar controller when you press yeah here the second view controller bling, 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 bling. okay stop and if you want to change this icon and this title you can go to select the for view controller like that and click this yeah. and you can see the image that you can choose when you select it select it select it on this tab what the image that you want to show okay here that default uh, title that you 
and say first or something you want for me at it's import is first and here the image that you want to input right now I don't have the image I just put this icon by default I just change the title and I will go to the second view controller to change the title to I change to second yeah like this and I change this background color to make sure it's right okay I think this color okay this color and build and run again Together, it will show the result that we have changed at the moment. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Boom. So it is first. It is second. Okay, let's go ahead to update. Yeah, I want to update to put uh, label there, there, here. Yeah, that's great. And align the center and increase the font size. change the color of the text to white and you can change the font to bar ok sorry to custom and you can change the font whatever you want oh, sorry yes can change change to add And I want to change it to first U control left boom and I central it and I set auto layout to horizontal and vertically in container and add to constraint like this make sure you don't forget to set width and height here and the constraint okay let's go ahead copy this my first command C and pass to this okay and center it okay you just add two constraints center and vertical Set it already and change this to second. So control. Okay, let's build and run together. Boom. Yeah, here this is the level that. We add it at the moment and click second, second, first, first. Okay, thank you for watching. And the next video, I will show you how to send the tab from the first tab to the second tab and also to the another tab bar controller. Okay, and more feature, something like uh, more icon to tab bar and customize tab bar color and also navigation controller okay so I hope you guys enjoy this tutorial and hope you to subscribe and like this video for get something like new
new video I'm editing on a YouTube channel. Okay, good luck. Thank you for watching. Bye. Oh.